what is the role of pressure in drying of foods in drying of foods we have to remove water we have to separate water from the food we have to convert the water into the vapor with the help of heat we know the boiling point of water is 100 degree centigrade but it is a pressure dependent when we decrease the pressure the boiling point of water decreases but when we increase the pressure the boiling point of water increases so here is a hint for us we have to remove water from the food we have to evaporate it at low temperatures so what should we do we will decrease the pressure during drying we will provide an atmosphere with low pressure which will enhance the removal of water from the food at low temperatures so we have to use low temperature but we will remove more water from the food but in case of cooking high pressure is used that is why pressure cookers are used to cook food in pressure cooker pressure high pressure is developed because of uh, because of which less time is uh, taken uh, to cook foods at at high pressures the boiling point increases that is why in cooking the high pressure is used but in case of the drying low pressure atmosphere is required in addition to remove water at low temperature use of low pressure uh, causes minimum change in the dried food quality foods contain heat sense to compounds for example vitamin c which are important nutrients for us they are destroyed during the drying at high temperatures using low pressure in drying will reduce such losses because the water present in the foods will evaporate at low temperatures this will reduce the heat abuse of foods during the drying this is the reason for using low pressure for the drying of foods and high pressure for cooking of foods thank you for watching